This is a titanium guitar pick, and it may be the most expensive pick you ever buy. And the true question is, does this guitar pick work? Does it sound any good? Is it worth the price? Let's find out. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the titanium guitar pick and I'm gonna pit it against my all-time favorite guitar pick ever created, the Jim Dunlop John Petrucci Trinity guitar pick. Will it fall short or will it come out superior? So overall opinion on this titanium guitar pick that cost me about 30 bucks on Amazon. Quite frankly, my opinion on this might surprise you a little bit because there's a good side and a bad side. I'll start with the bad side first. I think this thing is problematic in certain areas that are specific to my playing style and that is a no-no. First of all, I can't do any kind of pick scrapes or uh, rakes or whatever you want to call them where you're chunk chunk grrr, chunk chunk grrr. It makes weird video game sounds, which can be cool for something else, but not when you're trying to get that chunky chunk just gristle. When all of a sudden Mario starts popping in, it ain't gonna cut it. The other thing with this is that it's actually, you wouldn't think it, but it's a lot heavier than uh, the guitar picks that I'm used to. And it actually leads to a little bit of fatigue in my in my thumb and in my hand. It's, it's interesting because it's not necessarily that it's a bigger guitar pick, it's that it's heavier. So playing with it is a little bit different. It takes a little more muscle and your motor skills are kind of slowed a little bit with this pick. It doesn't seem like anything significant, but when you play with it for a little bit, you start to notice. The Trinity picks that I use are thick themselves, but there's still a little bit of give to them. And this has like no give. So it kind of pushes through the strings a little bit differently than the plastic or nylon that the other picks are made out of. So it's a very different kind of feel and you almost feel like you're gonna break your strings if you play too hard and honestly, you just might. The only other bad thing is honestly the price for what you're getting. I think it's actually a very cool uh, item to have. I will keep it around. I may use it for different things down the road and maybe I'll throw it in my wallet so I always have a guitar pick and it's something that'll last forever. But 
with it being so expensive, it's something I don't want to lose. And with my track history and probably yours too, uh, as a guitar player, we lose picks all the time. And if I lost this, I would probably never buy one again because that is a $30 expense just to get lost. Now let's talk about some of the good things. You are definitely getting a guitar pick that is durable and that is gonna last you a long time if you don't lose it. This does not seem to grind away like some other metal guitar picks that I've used before. I got some guitar picks from a different company that I wanted to originally do some of these metal guitar pick videos with, but they grind away and they leave shreds of metal on your pickups and on your strings, and eventually they just grind away and they're not useful and they get jagged and stuff. This titanium, doesn't do that. I think this pick really shined on like the eight string when you're really hitting that low E. It really works well to ring that out. So maybe this guitar pick would be very good for a bass guitar as opposed to a normal guitar because it's able to hit that thall kind of genty low eight string a tone, really bring the note out and really hit the attack on it. And I think this is where this pick really shines. The other good thing is what I mentioned earlier is the cool sounds you can make of this thing. So you can add some interesting aspects to your music and interesting sounds with this guitar pick because you can run it on your strings and make robotic sounds, weird droney sounds, Mario sounds, whatever you can figure out. But this adds a little bit of extra texture that you can throw into things for fun. The other good thing is just it's something cool to say that you have. You have a titanium guitar pick. It means you're the ultimate guitar player because you have a titanium guitar pick. So should you go out and buy yourself one of these? I don't know. That's up to you. I'll provide a link with where I found it. Um, so you'll have to decide for yourself. Do you want to buy a cool, uh, durable guitar pick that you may lose, uh, that can be difficult to play with sometimes, you can't play very fast with it, makes really cool sounds, uh, it definitely works really well with the eight string like I mentioned before, and it's titanium. That choice is up to you. Other than that, before you go, make sure you watch the video right here and I will see you in the next video and um, subscribe.